uh, I went out to test if I can efficiently or efficiently, not efficiently, but quickly farm Jester's crates. I started in uh, in Sunday, but there I was uh, killing those turtles, and they didn't drop Jester's; they dropped the noble coin purses. So I figured out that I will move here. And uh, as far as I remember, if you farm, if you farm those and focus on them only. It should be around 80 silver per labor if you open it up, maybe even more. Yeah, but I still wonder if I should focus on those weak, uh, weak monsters here, or maybe move to this. Like, there were some giants close to Locus Steps somewhere here. There is this giant field, and I wonder if I should go there instead. If if one star monster has a better chance of dropping those. Oh yeah, I for forgot about Carcassi totally. I was looking at, th at those zones and everything was like in uh, Danger 1 and I forgot about Carcassi. Assumes that okay, maybe I'm in a bad luck because, you know, servers were down yesterday. And th hello, Hadric. So thanks, I will go there right away, I think. There were two uh, areas in Carcassi that I've liked to farm in the past. One was with those scorpions and second one was, was with like larva bugs of bug looking uh, monster. Okay, but compensation is compensation, and anyone knows what what happens next with those uh, with those golden keys. I, and hello, Narcissus. Yeah, I, I must say that the regret event is working for me. I had terrible start, and to be honest, for a for a brief moment, I was thinking like, "What the fuck I'm doing here on this server? Maybe I should just pack my toys and move back on legacy server." Because what happened was that I I've got a lot of uh, Delphinat items or upgradable Epheriums, and I've collected like eight prepared superior regret scrolls. And thank you for follow. I've prepared, you know combination of uh, unique delphinad item or celestial delphinad item then I've added resplendent scroll plus uh, superior red regret charm or red regret charm eight of those and eight pairs of those so it was expensive to collect but I had some extra apexes so I didn't pay with my uh, my EU gold I paid with like NA cre credits that I've managed to gather er earlier and the start was like uh, one Epherium shoes went to Divine with great success from Unique, and seven Delphinat items, including my main weapons, they were downgraded to Arcane. And I was like, okay, I have no money now. So I was like, hmm, I remember that I have some uh, legacy money in, in my pocket. So I went back on legacy. I've bought uh, five uh, Obsidian flutes and started regrading them with the same method. And uh, I've got like three great successes in a row. What what never happened, and I think it's extreme RNG uh, luck. But it was like legacy, so yeah, those items were like, uh, let's say I I made profits there on legacy, but I cannot use it on on first start, right? 
So it was like, hmm, maybe I should stay on Legacy instead if, if RNG Jesus tells me to stay there. No, it's not a trash. I think it's really good. If you are playing on first start server, if you are on Legacy, then maybe not. But for me, you know, 20 armor regrades. Look how expensive those those are. Like 60 gold each. That's huge. And you get 20 for free on one account. And in my case, I have two accounts, so I get 40. Uh, I think that's that's really good thing, and it will allow me to uh, it will allow me to regrade much more. Uh, coffee and nipples. If you check the glip or the store that's currently not in glip, but they are like re redirecting you to the, their website. If you check the store uh, for zero credits, you should have some kind of compensation that gives you. Uh, let me show you. Ten bound green regrade charms. Ten bound blue regrade charms. 10 bound weapon regrade scrolls, uh, 10 bound accessory scrolls, and 20 armor scrolls. Now, running the government, wait. Is this a bot? No honor. And he buffed. Hmm. Strange. But let me show you something, if it's possible. I think I bought most of those maps. Basically what I did before I started streaming, I've checked the map uh, map list, those uh, rare ones, because they are, they are like really cheap and they might give you good profit. They actually did uh, give me good profit. I think I've sold everything. Yeah, I sold those Arcums for like 400 gold or something in total, maybe 300. But the thing is that it's really simple to make a list of those maps here that would reduce like... Uh, area of the map, area of, of locations to visit to like only Aurora. So when you open the world map, let's see if I can do both. Yeah. So right now I'm on Karkasi. Karkis, Karkasi is like South 11 if you are using Sextant. So this is South 11 here on this line. Let me draw it for you. Somewhere here is South 11. And if you look at the map list and you go like here, this line is around South 4, South 3. If you aim for maps that are only with South coordinates that are always above, uh, let's say, South 5, you will end up with maps that are located only in Aurora. So I've bought like 50 of those and it took me, I don't know, one hour to open 50 maps. And after I have opened 50 maps, I've uh, found like uh, 9 books of Aurora, which is around 100 gold. And the Archeum value was around 400 gold as well. And I think I'm going to die now. Oh no, Steve. Mm -hmm. Look, stream snipe. And I'm telling you how to make money. Thank you, Steve. Okay, we need to get rid of Steve out of this stream. <laughs> or maybe I had it coming because I was disturbing his streams as well. Oh, you see, payback. <laughs> no worries, plenty. Oh, look, there's my friend. That's his level 54 and 0 kills. <laughs> Don't kill him, baby. I, I, I'm I still wondering if it, this is a bot or not, because look how he's moving. Okay, he won't be moving anytime soon, but... Okay, he summoned his mount. Is he trying to escape with the mount? Okay, he looks like a unexperienced player who tries to escape, but I don't know.
Okay, he has you on target right now. So I think he knows that you are after him. <laughs> Enigmatist. Okay. <laughs> and where is Steve, protector of Nuyans? Where is Steve? Oh, there is Steve, protector of Nuya. <laughs> I've got a front seat for this fight. You see, Steve? You shouldn't kill poor streamers, okay? <laughs> Look, he's trying to escape or not? No, he's fighting, okay. Let's help him. <laughs> And Steve, my pet, my pet hit you once, and I've got some honor. Plus four honor points. Thank you, Steve. No, <laughs> you didn't tap to my pet. I used his skill, Body Slam, here, and it's really awesome skill, guys. If you are considering uh, getting a pet, I recommend this one because of this skill. Uh, it's perfect for some players because I don't know why I'm a clicker so don't ask me I have totally fucked up uh, playstyle but some of those players that are uh, playing with their keyboards entirely without clicking uh, I think they have problems with uh, switching targets during the combat so this pet's, this pet's ability body slam is uh, changing their target it's not only it's like provoking them and switching their targets so it saved my ass multiple times and I, thanks to this pet i've managed i'm like 4k gear score and i've managed to beat like uh, abolishers 4.5k gear score and those videos maybe you saw them on youtube with uh, cd tivo same story this pet saved my ass because he was like taking taking them damage instead of me they didn't notice what happened and you know poof you use the skill your pet is taking target and uh, Steve uh, Steve lost it for a moment and he petrified my pet okay let's see if it refreshed yep so now I'm going to get myself some red regret charms and this is why I love farming an A because normally I would be like really upset if I would have to get those apexes here on EU and spend my main character's money to get those regret charms but uh, when it's about spending opposite uh, region credits or gold it's it's not a problem I, I can focus entirely on getting credits on NA so let's hope it will be worth There it is. There it is. This is how you do it. <laughs> Thank you. Yes. Yes. Wait, we have some people that want to be on the stream. There they are. So yeah, that's it from me. Thank you very much for visiting. It was really cool. We had some really nice conversations. And let's 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 hope I will be there tomorrow. If not, expect a, a YouTube video somewhere closer to Monday or uh, maybe Wednesday. <laughs>